Now, following a court order granting leader of the Islamic movement in Nigeria, IMN Ibrahim el leave to travel to India for medical treatment, Nigerians have been reacting to the development. Some who spoke to TV360 Nigeria said the government have taken the right decision by granting el uh, leave to travel and believes this will put an end to violent protests in Abuja by the Islamic group. This next report has the details. At last, Ibrahim el leader of the Islamic movement in Nigeria, has arrived for medical treatment. After years of protests for his release, a federal high court granted him permission to leave the country to seek medical attention for injuries sustained during arrests in 2015. Some Nigerians have applauded the courts for allowing el travel. They say it will quell the violent protests that have rocked the country in recent time. What they are looking for is government to release the man to go to his medical checkup. As long as government have done it, have you seen them today? Eh? Yeah. You check tomorrow, what are you going to see them? No, Nobody is going to see them. Because what they want is that man to go for his treatment. Because his man is not well. For now, we will, really, we will enjoy relative peace. Whatever they do now, they are looking for trouble. Because they have disturbed the government and the government have accepted and they have let the man go to go and treat himself. What else do they want? What would they be coming for? What would they be coming for? What would they be protesting in the street for? So the government will not have a case against them. You said it is your boss that you want to go and we have allowed him to go. So what else? Security agents accompanied the Zagzaki on the trip and he's expected to be under strict surveillance. Back here in the country, residents of Abuja suggest that the government closely watches members of the IMN too. Though the protests may subside anyway, but their activities will not cease. As long as government permits them to still exist as an organization or as a religious group, which the activities does not go well with the with the government of the day. So if government permits them, I think they are on a mission and they have a target. As I'm concerned, they have not hit their target yet. So government should not relax on that. They should keep them on watch. Supporters of the Shiite movement had demanded that the government releases El Zagzaki to attend to his health needs. He only arrived in India on Tuesday afternoon so it's unclear at the moment how long he'll be there for. Anetta Felix, TV360, Nigeria.